Grief counselors will be at an upstate high school when students return from the Labor Day break tomorrow morning. The Cherokee County School District says it's learned the 16-year-old girl killed in a crash on the Blue Ridge Parkway Saturday was a Gaffney High School student. Ben Hoover is joining us live this evening from the high school where the superintendent says Macy Broom was a junior. So, Ben, what else have you found out about what's happened? Well, Tom, Superintendent Quincy Moore also says that Macy Broom was a student at the Institute of Innovation, and that is why grief counselors will be at both schools, including another school in the Cherokee County School District. That would be uh, one of the elementary schools, uh, Northwest Elementary, because that's where Macy's younger brothers are currently students. I've also learned that Macy's father works for the Gaffney Fire Department for about 15 years. He's been there as a firefighter. I spoke over the phone with Chief Jamie Gagnano, who is also off for Labor Day today. He tells me he was alerted early Sunday about the crash that killed the daughter of one of his firefighters. The department has reached out to Macy's family to express their condolences to let them know that the firefighters are there for them, and they've also already taken some items over to the family home. Chief Cagniano also asked that the community pray for the family in this time of need. And here's what we have learned about the crash Saturday night from authorities with the Blue Ridge Parkway Park Service. Macy was a passenger. She was in the back seat of a car being driven by a 21-year-old man who attempted to pass another car on the parkway when he lost control in a curve rolled the car down an embankment about 200 feet. Macy was thrown from the vehicle and was pinned underneath and she died instantly at the scene. We're told that charges are pending and that the speed is believed to be a factor in that crash. We're live at Gaffney High School, Ben Hoover, 7 News.